Angeles, California. Welcome to Pure Evil, where we dive deep into the darkest corners of human tragedy. Today, we will explore the chilling and horrifying crimes of one of America's most notorious serial killers, Richard Ramirez. Brace yourself as we uncover the shocking details of his reign of terror. Richard Ramirez, also known as the Night Stalker, terrorized the streets of Los Angeles and San Francisco during the mid-1980s. Born on February 29, 1960 in El Paso, Texas, Ramirez grew up in a troubled household. His exposure to violence and his fascination with Satanism would later shape his twisted path. Ramirez's criminal journey began with a series of burglaries and home invasions. However, it didn't take long for his crimes to escalate to a level of unthinkable brutality. His first known murder occurred on April 10, 1984, when he took the life of a nine-year-old girl. Ramirez's victims ranged in age, gender, and social status, making it clear that he had no specific target. His modus operandi involved breaking into homes where he would brutally assault, rape, and murder his victims. The sheer randomness and brutality of his crimes struck fear into the hearts of the entire community. Law enforcement agencies were under immense pressure to catch the Night Stalker. Their breakthrough came in August 1985 when Ramirez's fingerprints were found at a crime scene. This crucial evidence led to his identification and subsequent arrest. The trial of Richard Ramirez was widely covered by the media, attracting national attention. His courtroom antics and devilish smile only added to the horror surrounding his case. On September 20, 1989, Ramirez was found guilty of 13 counts of murder, along with numerous counts of rape, burglary, and other crimes. Ramirez was sentenced to death and spent the remainder of his life on death row at San Quentin State Prison. Despite his conviction, Ramirez maintained a cult-like following and received letters and marriage proposals from admirers. On June 7, 2013, Richard Ramirez passed away due to complications from B-cell lymphoma. His death brought relief to the survivors and the families of his victims, finally closing a dark chapter in American criminal history. The crimes of Richard Ramirez serve as a chilling reminder of the depths of human depravity. His reign of terror left a lasting impact on the communities he targeted, and his name will forever be associated with unspeakable evil. Thank you for joining us on this journey into the horrifying crimes of Richard Ramirez. If you found this video informative, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more gripping true crime stories. Stay safe, and until next time, remember to always keep an eye on the shadows. They are desires whereas if, where if I didn't give in to them, I would be crushed by them. I believe in the, in the evil in human nature. This is a wicked, wicked world. And uh, in a wicked world, you, wicked people are born. I'm not gonna blame society, my race, or people, or anything. Uh, it, it is up to the individual like myself uh, to, to keep on knocking on, on whatever door they want to get into.